what's happened? I think, I think, I think I'm dying. Wait, no, you're not dying. You're not, okay? I'm gonna get help. You're gonna be fine. Hi, I need an ambulance. Jacob's Fall Church Lane, Emmerdale. Yeah? Well, does Zebby know? No, it's okay, it's okay. Just, just leave it to me, I'm on my way. Sarah's collapsed. Belle thinks it's a heart. Up to date with all your anti-rejection, mate, Sarah. Lovely stuff. This'll tell us what's going on with your heart, but it sounds like you know the drill. It's an electric heart, you go. Easy for you to say. Did you feel any pressure or pain in your chest? No, I just couldn't catch my breath. We were at the hot the other day and she was fine. She'll be right. Just you wait. What's that face for? She was just being weird earlier. Talking about tracking her fitness, looking after her heart, but talking about dying. Why would she say that out of nowhere? Well, obviously, she's been really upset about the Anna, but, I mean, look at her. It's clearly more than that. You two are as thick as thieves. You noticed anything? Only the usual teenage angst. Yeah. And she'd tell me if she was ill. Would she? When all she knows about illness is people lying about it. I'll go in with her. I'll see you there. OK, that's all good, but we'll take you in for some tests, OK? He's excellent. ECG is clear. How come I had a heart attack? You didn't, thankfully. It was an anxiety attack. Now, they can be very scary indeed, and you're right to call an ambulance with your history. Have you been stressed out? Maybe, I guess. Probably because you thought she had cancer. Ooh, here we go again. You went on about it enough. Look, stop it. Guys, can't you ever just leave her alone? Why should I? You're here because of her. No, I'm not. Can we all just calm down? Why not ask the lass herself? Oh, no, I'm sorry. I forgot you're only interested in sticks to beat us with. So that's probably a yes to stress, then. I'll dig you out a leaflet on coping with anxiety. And then can I go home? Just waiting on your consultant to release you. Shouldn't be too long. Right, well, someone better ring Mum and tell her not to come. But she still want to see you. Well, it's nothing. There's no point. How is this nothing? I'll ring her, love. Fine. You call Debs, then get lost. We'll take it from here. You know where the door is. 